What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I want to talk furthermore about the Fawn Exotic Hand Cannon and whether or not this weapon should be nerfed because it's general control over PvP, Iron Banner and the Trials of Osiris. Now last week I uploaded a video asking you guys if you think the Fawn should be nerfed or not. I created a straw poll in that video and in today's video we're going to check out the straw poll we're going to see how many of you guys want this bad boy nerfed and how many of you guys do not want this bad boy nerfed now taking a look on reddit and watching other people's youtube videos there is a massive problem with pvp and it's not just the phone it's also the last word and shotguns blinking shotguns the range of shotguns and so forth and if you guys don't know we of course you know that old does destiny he created an amazing video which i will link in the video description which you guys should definitely check out in this video he talks about all the problems with pvp and what's causing and ruining pvp at this current moment in time and that is he talks about the fawn he talks about the last word he talks about blinking shotgunners he talks about the range of shotguns and he also talks about the foul winter's life now all of these things are major problems with pvp whether you like to admit it or not it's making PvP really unbalanced. The time to kill in PvP with these weapons, and you've heard me say it before, it's too damn quick. We expect a lot longer of a time to kill in Destiny. The way it was before, even when auto rifles had the error of PvP, you still weren't dying in a blink of a second. Now you do, and this is with hand cannons. Hand cannons should not be this powerful, and this was the point of my video, which I posted last week, and this was the point of Dato's video, which I will link in the video description if you do want to check it out. So basically I uploaded a video asking you guys if the fawn should be nerfed while giving you guys my personal opinion on what could be done to the fawn to fix it to make it basically balanced but I ain't gonna go into all of that now like I said you can check that out on the video I posted last week but we're gonna check out the straw poll and see how many of you bad boys wanted this weapon nerfed and how many of you guys did not want this weapon nerfed okay so we have over 11,000 votes which is incredible and by quite a big majority more people do want the four nerfed than don't we have 6,000 plus votes people want it nerfed and we have 4,000 plus votes people who don't want it nerfed it isn't as one-sided as I thought it would be seeing the amount of people who are basically bitching about this weapon on reddit and on youtube etc me included but it's still a mass majority 57% of people at this current moment in time I mean the straw poll will be updating it's getting thousands of votes daily so it's probably changed since me recording this video but it does seem as though the mass majority of the destiny community want the fawn nerfed and they agree that the fawn is in control of pvp now so like I promised in last week's video I will forward this to Brian you directly i will dm deej i will dm a few of the devs making sure they see this shit and making sure they do something about the phone i know this video is going to get disliked i know a lot of you guys want the phone to stay the way it is i know a lot of you guys can't perform in pvp without the phone which is a bit of a shame to be honest but in my opinion and a lot of other people's opinions it is ruining pvp it really is the phone the last word the range of shotguns and blinking shotguns all need to be sorted out somehow but guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for stopping by as always thanks for voting if you did and peace out until next time peace